All right, this one says the scatter plot below shows the amount of electric energy generated in millions of megawatt hours by nuclear sources over a 10 year period. So you can see we have sort of a uh, quadratic function represented. It says of the following equations, which model or which best models the data in the scatter plot. So we have a bunch of equations. How do we solve this? Well, first off, we have to look at the general trend of points, right? So if I'm looking at this, we can see that, yes, these are all quadratics. And so we know that quadratics, they either open up, the parabola either opens up upwards or downwards. Okay, if the parabola opens up like a U, that means the coefficient in front of the x squared term is going to be positive. Okay, if it opens downward like a smiley face, then the coefficient in front of x squared will be a negative. Okay, so if we look at our points here on a graph, I think this is a negative. It's a smiley, like, it's a sad face right so if we i don't know if we theoretically pointed uh, plotted some points of where the, the uh points were going to go it looks something like that so we're going to eliminate any of our answer choices that have a positive coefficient in front of our x squared term for the coefficient so that gets rid of a gets rid of c all right the next thing we're going to do is find the row why did i just do that the next thing we're going to do is find the relative y-intercept because we can see here in b we have a negative y-intercept in D, we have a positive y-intercept. We can see here on our y-axis on our little graph, these are all positive values. And so if we draw our general trend of the points, I don't know, it's going to be somewhere around 740, 745, right? So that makes sense right there. And because these y-axis values are positive, our y-intercept is our y-value when x is 0. So we see here on the x-axis, when x is 0, 0, that lines up. It's going to intersect somewhere there. Okay, they're nowhere near is it going to be a negative value. Therefore, it cannot be B, and our correct answer in this case is choice D.